Is it the thanks that I get for putting you bitches on? Is it my fault that all of you bitches gone? Should've sent the thank you note, your little hoe. Now I'ma wrap your corner with a bow. T H Q. The Homo University. Sorry, I just had to do that um, because that's my favorite song on the album. Yeah. So yeah. So so hey guys. So hey. 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 This week is uh, Poems Week, and I had a few poems in mind. Like I had this. There's this one that my I didn't I didn't write it. My stepbrother wrote it for me um, when we were working at the Snoqualmie Lodge, and um, it was about me being gay and people not accepting me. And like I think one of the lines that stood out was like. He bleeds the same color as us, and <laughs> his snot is the same color as us. I don't know. It was really amateur, but I enjoyed it. I mean, maybe I could read it in another video if you guys want. But the poem I wanted to read, <laughs> I wrote when I was in art school, and it was actually, like, it was for my illustration class, and we had to do an illustration off of a poem. And basically, it was a free-range assignment, because he was like, you can write your own poem. So basically, you could, like, write a poem about whatever you want, and then draw whatever you want for it. And so, um, but I didn't, like, completely take advantage of that. Like, I took advantage of it, but I was on, like, hoo hoo hoo, I'm gonna draw a rainbow and rehearse <laughs> in your Sahara, derp, derp, derp. I'm not even saying anything right now. Psychology fact, 90% of what comes out of a child's mouth, a boy's mouth, is noise. So I wrote this poem, and I wrote the poem after I was a drunk bitch one night. I cheated, I guess, on this guy that I was interested in. Like, we'd been talking for a few months, and... There was I love yous, and I did love him, but I got, I was a drunk bitch at a party, and shit happened. No, this isn't, this wasn't with my last relationship, if some of you guys are thinking that this is, it's happened twice, I know, I'm a whore, and I'm horrible. Anyways, I don't, this isn't, the poem is about how I felt. My heart is broken. The only thing I can feel is a beating on the edge of its cage, but... Even that feels faint. Almost arbitrary. My actions are a poison to myself. My hierarchy of needs is skewed. I look for love before I eat or breathe. I search for love, but all I find is this numb sensation. And the illustration that went with this was this beautiful piece of work that I never really finished. But that was my poem. I mean, of course I'm a hopeless romantic, but I don't think my heart hierarchy of needs is messed up so much anymore. Like, of course I want love, but I've come to realize that there's some other needs that you need to put before going out and searching for it. So, that's my poem. And I just learned that Eric is in detention tomorrow, so your shit's fucked. Just kidding. I love you. I love everyone.